my name is Walid Sultan Medeni. I'm 20 year old. I'm a engineer and uh, I'm the CEO and founder of Digital Mania. It's an uh, independent video game studio in Tunisia that uh, it born uh, four weeks, uh, four months ago uh, in September. And uh, w our main uh, uh, objective and our main mission is to create uh, the first uh, video game that is worldwide a little bit uh, uh, famous. Uh, uh, and made it in Tunisia. So our team is fully Tunisian guys and you have to understand something that in Tunisia there is no school about video games so everybody is learning by himself. I started when I was in school uh, with some friends. We created the Tunisia games. Uh, it was the first community of gamers in Tunisia. It was a website and after we made a lot of uh, competition, uh, local competition about video games, so Counter-Strike, Pro Evolution Soccer, etc. And uh, we made also the first big national event in Tunisia, we we'll call it the Tunisian uh, Cup, Video Games Cup. But uh, probably the crisis came, so uh, the big companies, especially here in Tunisia, uh, they cut their budget about the events and organizing events. So uh, 2008, 2009, uh, no event in 2009, no event in 2010. So uh, it was really the time to start something new after seven years of working from, to the, to, let's say, 2003 uh, till 2010. So uh, I started building uh, my own team and uh, especially to learn how to do video games. And uh, after two years of, uh, of fighting with investors, with banks, with the system and with administration, um, Digital Mania is official, was officially created uh, four months ago. So, till now I'm, I'm searching, um, we are all the time searching for uh, skills and uh, in fact there is no uh, specialized skills in this field. So the, my big challenge was just to detect the, the talent uh, but it was bread, it was not really like a diamond, you know, when you take it from the rock, it's ugly. It's, but if you are a specialist, you can feel uh, that it has a lot of, uh, a lot of value. So uh, what, uh, that's what I made for two years, trying to find guys uh, that have skills but hide it and making them, putting them in, in this office and uh, let them uh, explore their talent and do, uh, do what they really want to do. Yeah, it's uh, you know video games. It's uh, it combines art and engineering, and the engineers are very strict, and art the guys thinking in brushes and colors, and so try to make the the two the two words working together. It it's also big challenge, but it, it, there is a lot of it, man, the guys are really awesome. Huh? Uh, the, the team is very uh, they are open to everything. So even a guy who never developed it, and he's a drawer, he's an artist, he tried to learn how to develop and vice versa. And uh, uh, what that we really made the digital mania grow and really be strong, it was really the guys. Because they, their mentality, they came with, okay, we want to do something, something new, even if, if it will be very hard. And uh, voilà, that, that is digital mania in Australia. Uh, in fact, in video game market in Tunisia is very special uh, because, as you know, that we have a lot of uh, hack. So you can buy a game for two dinner. Uh, you cannot say that to all the, the, all the world. <laughs> so there is not really a market for doing business in selling video games in Tunisia. But uh, there is a lot of gamers. Mobile, Facebook. Uh, there is a 3.2 million Tunisian on Facebook, I think. And uh, the guys, everybody now have a PC at home, and uh, everybody is playing uh, the games, the famous games. Everybody is playing it, but a lot of hack. So now the the solution for this was a game that is free to play, but where uh, to 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 that you can um, go more and more. You can or it's faster. Uh, you can buy small things with a simple SMS. 500 million or one dinner, and the, the, the price is, is called freemium. 
And um, this is for to attack the Tunisian market. In fact, you are not obliged to buy because otherwise everybody will hack us. Let's be clear. So, okay, it's a free game, but if you want to go faster, you just to have pay small amounts. And uh, and from the beginning, also the aim it was the internet, the French community because. Uh, the, the games will be in French, but as you can see, all our games that we uh, release it, it's in English, was in English, and, uh, and the, the, the real aim, the real market is international. It's Android market, it's uh, App Store, and it's Facebook, and of course Xbox Live Network. This game, it's uh, the first game that that we made, and it, it's called the Lean Game. It's about uh, the, the lean management, and it's uh, some kind of technique of management used in the big industries, etc. And with this, it was our first project in Digital Mania. Wow! It's uh, let's say it's 80% finished. So you have this guy, John Smith. He's uh, 40, uh, 45 years old, he spent 25 years uh, working in industry and he, he's a big specialist on lean management and he took, he bought this factory doing small trucks, toy trucks and uh, he, uh, he had three months for making the, 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 this factory uh, coming back again and uh, making money etc. So he will start, he will move around talking to everybody. So it's, it's a real uh, role play game. So, uh, a small application after the revolution. Uh, so uh, the, the main feature on it is uh, that the famous degage, everybody go in front of the, went in front of the Ministry of, uh, of the Defense in Tunisia and they said to, uh, to Ben Ali, degage, degage, degage. So you just take a phone like that, when you do the jest, it's saying dégage with the sound of everybody, and it was taken live. Huh? The, the sound it uh, was taken live uh, there. And so you are the first one seeing this huh, in the world, and it's uh, here. It's really behind the scenes because it's a prototype, so it's not going to be like that at all. But just putting big things just to see if it's nice, not nice, and you are trying. So here you have some characters from the ones that you are seeing here. So you you have. Uh, you have this one, you have this one, you have the flying one there. They're all here, so you can see here. Up, up. Up, up. And uh, this, w w this game, his name is Defendur. So you have to defend your door against uh, players on Facebook. So you have to, to send your army and uh, all the characters is a little bit funny and uh, they all have small things. So th this is really a prototype. We started developing this, uh, let's say, one month ago, but for doing the game design document, etc. And now we are really in the prototyping the, the game. I also started this after seven years of events and video games, so I know exactly what gamers want and uh, what they need and how do they act with so you need to be in the field so you cannot uh, just be a, a doctor uh, in uh, medicine and just going on and farming like that you know you have to be in the field to understand uh, how it's working you have to be uh, you, you have to know how to uh, onto yourself how to, 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 to put people next to you the team is is the is the critical point uh, the, the market it can collapse, it can go up, it can. You 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 not you don't have control on this, but your team you have control on that, and it's really the, the critical point. And after, of course, you have to be uh, uh, pragmatic, if you can say this in English. It's uh, about the market, about what you are going to do, how how many time is going to take you, and how, how much money. So this is really very, very important. So not to say, okay, I'm a crazy guy, I'm going to do something very nice just to be fancy or showy, you know? No, it has to be very, uh, very it has to be serious behind. Okay, we're doing video games and we're playing and you can, you see the ambience is very funny, but behind it's, uh, it's very serious. It's, uh, it's a real business and uh, we, are, we are not playing. Never say, don't, don't hit anybody. 
if they say if they tell you no, it's not possible, you're going the wrong way, etc. So try to, to take the best thing, uh, of course, huh? because there's people with experience and advice is very important. But if somebody telling you no, say thank you and go ahead, try to find somebody else or try to do it by yourself. I think it's the the, the, the best thing that I can say because advice is, you know, you, you, you everybody has to learn from his own mistakes. But we can also learn from the mistakes from the others. But sometimes we, have, we also have to do our own mistakes, even if we know that uh, it's hurting or it's. Uh, <laughs> we have to, to, to have a pain to, to, uh, to learn from that. So uh, n never keep, uh, n never say, uh, how, 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 uh, never, uh, never give up. Yeah, exactly. Now, really, I think what we need, it's not only funding. Okay, funding, it's, it's not that difficult to fund. Uh, you can uh, directly have a credit from a bank if you, if you have some kind of sustainable uh, business or idea or something. But uh, today we need an open to knowledge. Uh, we need, uh, we have a lack of knowledge, and of, especially in some kind of fields. Huh? Uh, and we need more uh, opening to... Uh, to knowledge from the big companies or from from the big countries to, to help not just like coming and helping us like uh, taking our hand and do this no 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 just please open the door and we'll do what we need and we'll take what we need by ourselves and well, what I mean what we'll take we'll take knowledge huh? and after two three years with this knowledge we'll do our business we'll do our own money and we'll go back in two or three years and doing something together, 50-50 in the same level. The team. Building the team. Building the team and uh, keeping them. Th that was uh, the big challenge. Uh, you know, it's normal when you... When we started Digital Mania, we had five dinner, each one, every day. That was my budget, to eat. Everyone, just every morning, I come to everybody and say, this is your five dinner, five dinner, five dinner, five dinner, therefore that you know it's uh, two, two, two and a half euro, three dollars uh, to, to, to the whole day. So well, in Tunisia it's something, you know, we can have a sandwich and a soda and a bref. Uh, and the guys was very motivated with this. And now when we talk about this, well, now say uh, we, we, we went to another level, so now everybody is in a regular situation. Uh, administration <laughs> and they have their salary, their wage, etc., and uh, uh, taxes, and we pay everything. Okay, everything is okay. And uh, when when we when we speak about this, when we when, uh, we really have a big big loss. Well, I lost the half of the team, of course, uh, because of uh, a lot. I, I can understand. Uh, I can. We, we cannot say to people to to follow us to to the end and. Uh, yeah, but uh, I have guys who, who's with me from the beginning and uh, I will thank them uh, when everything will work. And it's really the spirit that you, I wanted to put in Digital Mania. It's like, it's cool, you can do what you want. Uh, the idea that you have, we can multiply it by 10 if, you, if it's nice and it's serious. It's still serious, and I will give you all what is needed. Just let's work, and let's try to do something different. And uh, well, uh, you know, the, the most part of the investment, uh, it's just for paying people. Huh? Well, what I need, it's only computers. That's all, and one TV. <laughs>